Hello everyone, how a top set knot has split them into three parts and how it break down in a thicker manner and do the braiding until you reach the bottom part of it and how another strip off hair from the sides and how it crisscross each other and how it tighten a little bit and how it secure with another rubber band and how another section of the hair roll better the first one and how it in an X manner and how it tightens and how it both of them combine together with a common draw band and how the last section of the hair and how it crisscross each other one more time and how it secure with another hair band then with the remaining section of the hair put them into two parts and how each of them split them into three parts and how it break up in a thicker manner do the same braiding on the right side and how each of the braid cross each other and how it's secured on the top and happen Grab the hair from the sides and tie in the middle of the rubber band. Then grab the left section of the hair and make it twist and go into the one cycle on the loop and how it come down. Then have the right section of the hair and do it the same way as we did for the left one and have both of them combined together into a common loop. Then have another section of the hair right with the first one on the left and how it go into the loop for one cycle and how it come down and do the same thing on the right side as well. Then combine both of them together into a common loop. Now do repeat this until you reach the bottom middle part of your ponytail and have the end secure the rubber band. Now with the remaining part of the ponytail, split them into three parts and have it braided in a very thicker manner so once when you complete the braid have the braids and secure the rubber band but don't forget to pinch out the braid side to the maximum as you could for the loopy design then drop in your favorite hair flip collection on the round and parts of the braid Grab the sides of your hair and tie it in the middle of the rubber band and drop it inside going for the twister band and have a section of the hair from the left side and twist it a little bit and drop it inside the loop and have another section of the hair right below it and drop it inside the loop as we did before but near to it. Do it until you empty the left section completely. Then also with the right section of the hair combined with the left section, how it could split them into three parts and how it braid it in a very thicker manner. Then after you complete the braiding, have the braids and secure the rubber band and move the braid to the left side and bend it over and stuff it inside the gap and how it secure the position would happen. Grab a strip of hair from the left side and split them into two parts and have it braid in a thinner manner. So once when you complete the braid, have it secure on the opposite side strip with a rubber band. Then with that strip as a reference, have it braid in the same way by splitting them into two parts and attach it to the left side strip. Then drop it inside going for a twisted band once more and have it braid it once again and moving it on to the right side. Then do continue the braiding the same way as we did before splitting them into two parts and having it go across each other and have it to the strip on the opposite side. Then have it the same way as we did before in the braiding and split them into two parts again. Then have it go across each other and I secure it on the opposite side strip and go in for a twisted pan. Grab your hair from the sides and tie in the middle of the rubber band and drop it inside going for the twister band. Then grab even more hair from the section right below it and have it tie the same way and go for the twister band once again. Then with the remaining section of the hair, split them into three ponytails and have the rubber band attached in the top middle part and drop the tail into the middle one and drop the tail entirely into the second lump we had. Now do the same for the other two ponytails as well. Now with the remaining section of the hair, on the left and right, make a ponytail out of it and have another rubber band attached to the top middle part and drop the tail into it and make the entire lump go near to the first lump we had. Then do the same for the section of the lump on the right side as well and combine both the tails together and stuff it inside the one we created once again we are back to our favorite design grab the hair from the sides and tie in the middle with the rubber band and drop it inside going for a twister band and grab another section of the hair right below the first one and go for a twister band once again but this time go for a twister band even more thicker than the first two and have it the same way then continue doing this until you reach the bottom middle part of your tail now with the remaining part of the tail do it in an alternative manner by going for a twister band but tighten it a little bit for boosting the volume and after you do it have the end secure with the rubber band and braid the ends a little bit and tie the braid into the first one we just created then have it stuffed inside thank you everyone for watching this video.